Okay. So, in, so I created a pathways using um, plastic uh, piles. Oh, yeah. uh, these are just experiments, they are not um, complete studio work. Okay. But I, <coughs> I used these ideas, although they didn't show up in my exhibition, but I I used these ideas in deep, uh, in my previous work. Oh. I created um, three pathways with uh, different uh, shapes, shapes and different colors. Mm -hmm. I wanted to keep as simple as possible, so I I used uh, primary colors. Mm -hmm. So and I also. I uh, created a contrast uh, contrast for this work because I was also interested in the boundary uh, between the between the um, world of escape after you escape and before you escape. Escape can have different meaning to different people, so. Um, the people can either uh, come from this way to towards the door or mm. go go out of the doors. Okay. Yeah. I focused on uh, stairways, uh, doors, ladders. To mm. I I was uh, interested in how can I explore these um, objects to express the, the process of escape and mm. the act action of escape. I simply wanted to show the, the, like, the world of escape, not the um, real reality. It's uh, different from real world. Uh, for this one, I I wanted to um, use animals to uh, sh to uh, express my theme because I think uh, animal always like rabbits and go goldfish is always they try to escape from um, environment their environment okay of uh, what they fear of so. I use animals to um, uh, to develop my theme, and I thought I wanted to them to go through a different like this loop can be uh, can interpreted as a, a grassland, and so the rabbit is basically trying to uh, go through the go through whatever she, she she's afraid of. Mm. Um, next, I was uh, focused on different composition of um, gates, like uh, here and here, and also there. So I thought um, different composition and arrangement uh, can can give people a different feeling mm. about um, escape. I sometimes arrange them uh, randomly and in for this and this um, because I I just wanted to see what will happen if I um, arrange them in random order. Yeah, this one is. Um, Little bit different from other works because um, they they are all kind of uh, have a very calm atmosphere mm. and peaceful. But for this, it's uh, it's very awful um, because I wanted to create a 
some powerful works that's different from others. This piece was um, uh, influenced by uh, artist called Zero E Power, mm -hmm. and he, in his artwork, he always make um, uh, patterns, uh, patterns and arches like this. Okay. This kind of patterns, and and his, uh, although his work. I think his work is really balanced and always sim uh, symmetrical. So mm -hmm. I want. So I adapted his idea to create a um, um, space for escaping, and I also used the um, uh, stairways to uh, to emphasize the my theme. Uh, I came up with a theme of escape because uh, me as a me as a high school student always under the pressure, and I really want to get away from the reality. So I saw theme can um, represent myself, mm. and so the at that point escape was a. Uh, has a negative meaning. Okay. A lot of negative meaning, and so, but as I as I develop my theme, I notice that uh, escape can have different meanings. Uh, depends on the situation. Yeah. And how you feel at that time. So, I realized that escape can sometimes uh, can have positive meanings such as growing up or uh, you grow as a person. I try to adopt um, different medium and different techniques mm -hmm. um, such as uh, paper cutting technique and um, different compositions. Thank you for watching.